2017. Thank goodness 2016 is over with. Happy New Year. I'm so glad that that is done because it has been a rough, bumpy year. Just from the beginning till the end. Bumpy road. So I'm excited about the next year. So that means that I'm going to go ahead and do a favorite products of 2016 because it's done and it's over with. So let's get started. So I guess first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to start with some cleansing products that I really, really love and have just kind of helped me out this year. So my first one is going to be, this is the Oil Obsessed Total Cleansing Oil from Bare Minerals. Love, love, love this product. This gets off everything. Waterproof mascara gets off my eyeliner, gets off everything that is on my face. Love it. Like, I don't know how many times I can say that. Love it. And I use it pretty much almost every single day and you see how much is still in there. Um, it's just great. It smells good. This is better than, I've tried a couple other oil um, cleansers. Haven't really liked them. This one does not leave my skin feeling oily and it doesn't make my skin feel... Like there's another one that I thought was really weird, but my skin feels kind of like dry, I guess, after it. It's really weird sounding from an oil, but yeah, it makes my skin feel dry. I don't get it. But this one, my skin feels perfectly moisturized and just fresh and clean and ready to go. So love this from Bare Minerals. This is their, this is one of their revamped beauty products because they did have this um, in an older line and then they revamped it and this is now the new one which just seemed a little bit more, see that, like liquidy. The other one seemed a little thicker. This one's a little bit, you know, liquidy. So love, love, love that product. Um, I think the only disclaimer I will tell you on this is that, you know, since it's oil, when you pop it in anything, if you get it on the bottle or anything like that, the bottle gets greasy and it like builds up under here. So if it's on wood or if it's on something, it soaks into that. So just be careful. If you have, you know, tile or something like that, that works, but yeah, wood or like anything cardboard. I don't know why you have on cardboard, um, but it'll soak up into that and that gets messy. So just that little, little thing there. Next I have, this is Burt's Bees Sensitive Facial Cleanser with cotton extract. Oh my God. <laughs> my skin has been getting dry lately and very sensitive to everything. It's been red and everything irritated. So I was kind of just looking through the drugstore and found this. Um, Burt's Bees, and I was like, I'll give it a try. Love this. I will be going through more of Burt's Bees products in order to see if I like any of those as well, but I love this. It's very creamy, just leaves my face feel moisturized. Just great. I mean, it, it doesn't irritate my skin like a lot of cleansers do, so I do reach for this quite often um, during the colder, drier months. Next, we have, this is Bare Men and Men and Men and Men. And then, and then, and then me. <laughs> this is Bare Minerals Bare Haven, and this is Essential Moisturizing Soft Cream. This is a moisturizer that I love to use before bed. I use it actually during uh, before work too because 12 hour shifts can be pretty long, and you know, I'm inside, so the air conditioning and, and heating just dries out my skin and irritates it. So, I do love using this, it's a thicker moisturizer, and yet again, during the cold months, that's my dog disagreeing apparently. And yet again, during the cold months, it's great to have a really thick moisturizer to help keep your skin happy, basically. So there's that one. And next I have, this is uh, ba Baptiste. Is that what you say? Baptiste, I think. Um, this is a dry shampoo. You will have heard me talk about this. I think it was the Target product review. And I was like, I tried it once and I kind of like it. I'm going to keep trying it and see how I like it, and I love it. Guess what? I love it. I was always hesitant with dry shampoos because I had a bad experience with a dry shampoo. We're just not going to talk about it. We're going to ignore it. Um, but this one actually is really good. So I'll just spray it in a couple spots that I, I feel are kind of super greasy or getting greasy. And I'll just spray it there, and I'll just brush through my hair as much as possible, flip it back, and ta-da. Like, my hair feels great and refreshed, and I love using this. Cause I don't wash my hair every single day. It's just not good for my hair. My hair dries out, gets stringy. Don't like it. So I don't wash my hair every single day. Um, and yeah, so this is a great thing to have if I have to freshen up before work or before an event. Um, or like, I just, it's one of those days where my hair's getting greasy and I'm like, I can't shower yet. You know, I can't, well, I shower every day. I'm gonna phrase that. I can't wash my hair yet. <laughs> 
So I love this one. Great. I will be purchasing the large size as well with this and possibly like multiples of it. So love that product. Next, we're going to move on to, this is Clinique's uh, Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer. If you guys haven't seen this yet, you need to check this out. This is kind of cool. It has like a little wand on it. You just dab all over your face and blend it in. And if you've been watching any of my videos, I have talked about this a lot. So I got two bottles of this as samples, kind of like during when they were running a promotion or something. I was buying some products. I got two bottles. Um, as a sample, they only had a couple colors to choose from, so I, you know, chose what was closer to my skin tone. Turned out to be a lot darker than my skin tone, so I went back and got matched and love this foundation. It stays on. I, like I said, I work 12-hour shifts. It stays on for 12 hours. That's insane. Um, you know, like, if there's spots that I'm messing with, I keep rubbing or, like, you know, I had to wipe my face off for some reason then yeah, it's coming off a little bit, but it's like I go to clean in the morning and there's still makeup on my face. So you know there's still some of this on my face after 12 hours, it's awesome. So this is in number seven, cream. I don't know how to say this, Chamois. I got nothing. Number seven. So this is Clinique, love it. It has a, it's called a matte, like it's a natural matte I think is what they call it. But it, so it mattes, but it's not like most mattes. You know I hate mattes. I'm not the biggest fan of matte products because I don't like the fact they dry, they dry me out and I am already have dry patches. just irritates me. But this one actually ends up with like a, a more natural finish than a matte. So as you can see, you know, it's not like super, you know, oh look, she's got matte foundation on her. It's super powdery or anything like that. Love that foundation. Um, let's move on to, I have a couple products in here. Ooh, you're gonna like this. So back on Black Friday, I went uh, online to Ulta and bought some stuff. So they had these, this promotion going that if you bought a certain amount of stuff that you would get a, a bag, like a makeup bag full of samples. I may have bought enough to get two of those bags. So I have two bags full of samples that I'm still working on so that I can, you know, review them and let you guys know what products are worth it and what's not. But this was in that bag. This was in one of those bags. So I actually have two because one was in each bag. Love it. This is Ico. Um, I do liquid line eyeliner. Amazing. This is in car, it's, I mean, black, carbon black. But this stuff, I tried it. It was one of those products when I tried it the first time, put a cat eye on. I was like, oh, I love it. It went on so smooth stayed on love the liner i have it on right now i'm just i just did a very subtle cat eye look going on there um love 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 this will be buying this in the full size i will go back i will buy this in full size but i have two of them so i'm just kind of like you know using these as much as i can and i will be purchasing this later on next product i technically have four of these but i have two of one color so here they are. These are from NARS. These are their, um, what are they called? Velvet matte lip uh, pencils. Can't say enough. I don't know how, like, all these products are obviously great products because these are the, my favorite products of 2016. But, oh my God. So I got these two, um, I think I was from Sephora as like a sample box or something. These two colors love them. I mean, I don't know what to say. I put this one on as a kind of like a daily. If I just have, if I have a bold eye, I like to go with a more neutral lip. So this is what I will go with. And then if I have, you know, a neutral lip, I'll go with a neutral lip, bold eye, or neutral eye, bold lip. I couldn't say that. I don't know why my brain wasn't clicking there. Um, this color though is, I'll type it in there because I got nothing. It's, it's an interesting word. Next one, this is Cruella. This is a red. I did wear this um, to a party. Loved it. Actually, I've worn it to several parties now. I love wearing it out. This is just matches my skin tone, goes with my dark hair. It's a very sexy red, and I love it. It's just like one of those kick-ass, strong women reds, and I loved it. So I went back to look for these two products, and I actually got the full size in 
this one, the neutral, and then this one, I was looking for this one, could not find it. So I will be going online to see if I can find it, but the lady that was there was helping me. She found this one. She's like, oh, this one's close. And it is. It's very close. Um, I think Cruella is just a little bit more of a darker red. So that's, that's just more red. Then this one has a little bit more, you know, it's a little brighter. This one is Mysterious Red. I have also worn this to several events. Love it. Like this was a very, this was a holiday one for me. Like I basically wore this one throughout December. Loved it. Cannot say enough about it. But yeah, the NARS Velvet Lip Pencils. Great job. I will be getting more of these. I will be getting more colors. Love these things. They just go on easily. They stay on. Love them. Next is another lip um, product. This is from Clinique. And you may have heard me talk about this a couple times. This is the Glazed Berry Lipstick from Clinique. I, you can tell I've used this a few times. It's just a perfect everyday color. So like if I want a little bit of color on my lips, like if I'm going to work or if I'm going out, you know, just with friends or I'm going to hang out at someone's house, but I don't want to look, you know, hoodie and half a dead. But this is a great color just to like, you know, spruce up my face a little bit. So I love this. It's very creamy, very soft. It's not, you know, not dry out my lips. I don't think this is even, it's not a matte. It says different lipstick. That's it. I don't know. Love that though. This is a great Clinique. I got this out of one of the Clinique bags. Just, this is, as you can tell, it's one of my go-tos. I use this thing all the time. Love that color. Next, we have, ooh, Dandelion. So this is Benefit Dandelion. It is a blush slash brightening powder. Very pretty, look at that. Um, it comes with a little brush in here that I actually use this brush all the time. As you can tell, it's very pink on the end there. Um, love it. It has a little mirror in there, which I think is super cute. Love this product. So this is the mini version of it. I was very hesitant on buying the large version. I didn't want to buy the large version because I was like, I don't know if it's going to be my color. I don't know if it's going to be bright enough for me. I don't think I'm going to like it. I just didn't know. So I wasn't going to go out and buy the large product, um, the full size product in this. But I was walking past, I was in Ulta for something else, completely something else. And I remember walking past and they had like a bowl of minis in there and I was like, oh my God, it's in there. And it was cheaper. So I was like, yeah, I went ahead and grabbed this. Good job, Benefit. I'm giving you a thumbs up on the minis because I also got the mini hula, which I do love as a nice little um, contour. Yeah, this was a great idea because then now I can try it and I will be, once I like kill this thing, I will be getting the full size. Love this color. Use it a lot. Use it all the time. Basically, this is my like go-to blush. Um, you will have seen this in my Get Ready With Me um, New Year's Eve video. Love, love, love that. So I was very glad they had a mini so I got to try it and fall absolutely head over heels for it. So next, ooh, I didn't, do, I didn't do these with the cleansers. I should have done it with cleansers, but it's okay. We got this. Face sheet masks. So I love doing kind of like spa treatments when I have a bad day or if I just, I'm like, oh, I would love to do a a bath and a mask and just relax for a little bit before bed. Love doing that. So I will normally do those. Those are normally like with the clay masks and things like that. So I started using these this year. Sheet masks. Fallen in love with them. Pretty much I will try any sheet mask you have. And as you can tell, I have a nice stock here. This is nowhere near even half of my stock, actually. I have quite a few. Um, Way to go Black Friday sales because they had Ulta had another sale on the masks and I stocked up definitely on those. So I have a couple different ones here. Let's see here. This one, these are one of my staples. Um, this is from Invigorating from, these you get these from Target. I get these from Target. I don't know if you can get them around anywhere else, but I do get these from Target. These are really nice. I think these are just a Target product. I don't think you can get them anywhere else. These are very nice. You know, they have the little thing on the bottom, invigorating, you know, there's, I think there's like energizing or something like that. Great, great sheet masks. And I love that because they're not as expensive as some of the other ones. When you go to Ulta or when you go to Sephora, they can get pricey. So this is a nice alternative because, you know, if you just want a girl's night, relax for a little bit, you don't need to be spending too much money on a mask. It's great. These, love, 
Love, love, love. Oh my God, I fell for these. These are Masquerade. I bought a few of these Black Friday sales um, from Ulta and the first one I tried just fell head over heels for them because like it smells great, it feels good, took it off, my skin felt amazing and I was like, oh uh, yeah, loving these. So I went back to the Ulta site um, to check these out again. I didn't see them on the Ulta site. I don't know if Ulta got rid of these or not, but they were on the Black Friday sale. I don't know if they got rid of them or not, but they do have their own website, so I will put the link to that in the description box. And I actually have that up on my laptop still, because I'm gonna go through the whole website and see what I would like to buy. Yeah, so <laughs> these are great. This is called I Don't Wanna Grow Up, Lift, Firm, and Soften Fine Lines. This one is Detox Diva, Cleanse, Exfoliate, and Detoxify, which I feel like after New Year's Eve, this might be a good idea for me. I think I'm gonna do the Diva, the Detox Diva tonight. That'll be nice. So I'm gonna do that. Last two that I have with me at the moment, because like I said, I've got a ton more in my bathroom. A ton. Um, these are just stinking cute, and I haven't tried them yet. I need to try them. But I've seen them before. I've seen other YouTubers use them. I've seen, you know, them reviewed and everything, and people love them, so I am going to try them. These are the, uh, it's SNP, I think, Animal Dragon, and then Animal Panda. These are the sheet masks that look like the animal faces. So when you put it on, you look like a panda, or you look like a dragon, or whatever else you got. And I just think that's just cute. I mean, obviously I'm not walking around the grocery store with it or anything, but it's cute. So I'm just going to try these out and see what I think about these. I was just excited because I was like, oh my god, they're the animal ones. I totally want to try those. So those are my sheet masks that I have been loving. Not all of them, but a good chunk of them. Next, oh, next one. Here we go. For a second, I completely forgot what I was looking at. Um, this is Bohemian from American Eagle. This is the body spray. Yeah, I smelled this a long time ago. It was like a couple years ago, I smelled this. And I loved it, but for some reason, I don't remember what it was, I didn't get it that day. I don't know, and I, I, I blame myself. I don't know why I didn't get it. Um, but I found this, we were up at the outlets. Um, I Very bad luck for me. I live next to an outlet, lots of shopping there. Um, so I was up there and they had these in the body spray. They also had the perfume bottles, but I really kind of like the body spray more because I use this more for just spraying all over me really quick, before work, going out to dinner, going out with friends, things like that. Love the smell. I don't know how to explain it. It's it's just, ah, smells really good. I'm, I, I'm horrible at describing smells too, so it's not like I'm gonna be any help. It just has this nice, I wanna say clean smell, but it's, it's not clean. It's like, it, you smell it and I'm reminded of like, the woods, but not in a musky way, not in a, a dirt smell way, but like in a just fresh air kind of way. And I love this scent. So I will be going back and seeing if I can get more, more, more of these. Love that smell. Um, and this is actually really funny because I did buy this towards the beginning of the year. I spray it all over my body. It's not like I'm spraying like two sprays and I'm done. No, I spray it like everywhere before work and before I go out to dinners and things like that. So basically a lot. And that's how much I've used. I'm liking this too. That's, that's what I used to have. So there's that. Now the next two products are not beauty products, but they're two products that I've absolutely loved all year long that have come in handy as well. So the first one are headphones. So these are the Philips um, Bluetooth, I think they're sound canceling as well, headphones. Oh my God. So I wanted a pair of Bluetooth headphones because you know, when you go upstairs and go to bed, like my husband's already asleep and then I want to watch YouTube videos on my computer. Well, I don't want to have the sound up because he gets cranky when I wake him up while he's asleep. So <laughs> I was like, I got to find Bluetooth headphones. Well, first thing I looked at, you know, obviously go to right now, big promotions and everything is Beats. I was like, no, I'm not spending $200 for a pair of Bluetooth headphones. Not happening. 
So I looked around and researched and Googled for a while because that's how I roll. If I'm interested in something, I will spend a while researching it, trying to make sure I get the, the perfect thing and get exactly what I want. I'm sorry, I have a hair on my face that is like itching me. And that's why I keep scratching. It's not like there's it's just a hair. I don't even know where it is. Can't see it, whatever. So back to the headphones. Um, but I love these because also you can flip them here and lay them flat in a, uh, like a case or something, or you can flip them up here and lay them flat somewhere um, in a case, in a suitcase, in a book peg, anything like that. So I love that about these. I went to, when we went to New York a couple months ago, these went with me and these were awesome because that's one thing you can rely on with my husband is the second it's it's not even like before the like the door closes on the plane the second he sits down in his seat he's asleep gone like not waking up till we're we're at our destination so i have no one to talk to <laughs> so i'm and i i can't sleep on a plane i don't know why i just can't um so i'm either reading or i'm on my computer or i have headphones in listening to a movie or music something right so yeah, these went to New York with me and they were used the entire time. Cause I would also watch YouTube videos when we got back to the hotel at night and he didn't want to listen to them. So there you go. Phillips headphones, love these, love. Next one is on my feet. So I'm actually gonna take one off so you can see it. This was not purchased like, you know, early in the year. This was basically purchased at the beginning of December. But I mean, I can't, I, I, I'm going to just tell you I love this thing and I may have purchased a lot of them. So I was at an event, it's called Shop of the Cop, if you know what it is. It's a lot of public safety foundations or police departments do this where they team up with Walmart and Walmart gives um, less fortunate children some money to go shopping for the holidays and they pair them up with public safety members and the public safety members help them go shop. Um, for these items in Walmart and it's an amazing event and every year I end up crying because these kids like I just like want to hug them and take them home They're such sweethearts. They're great kids great project all of these public safety members. It's police fire EMS Everybody involved just they volunteer their time um, They're not getting paid for it. They're not on shift. They volunteer their time to go and help these children for the holidays and it's amazing to watch and I've gone several years because I have a friend who actually runs the program uh, in a city near us so I go out and I support and I help and it's just an amazing event so if you ever get a chance check it out try and help support those events they're great like they are just amazing to see these kids smiles and it's they're such sweet children so back to the story back to my uh, products here I was in Walmart because I was doing that event and so after the event I was like I've got a secret Santa I've got to shop for and there's a couple things I'm trying to find so let's see if, if they have them here at Walmart. So I was running around and it's one of those things where this caught the corner of my eye and I was like oh, what is that? So I had to go check it out and this is what I got. So these are socks. Yeah right just socks. No, They're amazing. Look at the fluffiness in these socks like they are it's, it's not real. I don't think it's real wool, but it's like that wool feeling on the inside, that fluffy, you know, oh my God, I just can't. It's like having a pillow on your foot. It's amazing. So it's two layers. So the outside's like this stitched soft and then the inside is just super soft and fluffy. And this is a clean sock. I'm just going to point that out. I just picked this up before I came to visit, um, visit this video. No, <laughs> I just picked this up before I came down to record. So it's, it's a clean sock. And then on the bottom, there's the non-slip um, little dots and everything. Oh my God. These things keep me warm. Like my toes are always frozen in the winter. So to find a sock that keeps me, that actually keeps me warm. Amazing. Love these because I use them. They're basically like house slippers for me. Use them a lot. So that is it for my 2016 favorite products. I'm so glad this year's over. I wish I could say I wasn't and that I had a great year and I didn't. It was just a bumpy road and it was a struggle the whole year. It's one of those years where you feel like you're like climbing out of a hole that's just covered in you know mud and you're slipping everywhere. It was just one of those struggling years, but it's okay. 
because 2017 is here and I'm very optimistic for it. I feel like it's going to be a great year and I'm super excited. So I hope you guys have a great 2017 and I have so many videos planned already that I'm so excited about. So keep up with it. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you can keep up with the videos. And I can't wait to see you guys later. Have a good one. Have a good evening. Bye.